you want a world and a country that you live in for your children and grandchildren to be much better than what it was when you were young. Pentech Rugby Club was founded in 1882. We've got one of the largest numbers of minis and juniors. We play in the third division in the Welsh Rugby Union League system. For young people, the challenges of climate change are, you know, first and foremost in their minds. You know, it really is a priority for them. And as a club, everything we do is looking ahead to trying to provide for those future generations, essentially. To install the solar panels has been on our, on our wish list for the last four or five years. So we saw this and we decided to apply for it. We were informed that we'd been successful. We are uh, thoroughly happy that we've managed to install the solar panels, so we were very pleased with that. We were over the moon. Obviously, clubs like ourselves are not profit-making, so it's vital that we are supported, and grant systems are, are really a lifeline to us. So having a lottery grant is absolutely vital to the numbers game. If you see by me, all these kids, they all have the goals to be Wales' the next top rugby stars and without the funding, the kit and the facilities for them to actually have a chance to do it, then we wouldn't be able to even have ambitions to get there. This investment in the solar panels is a really big step forward for us as a club. It is at the centre of what we're doing and I think if we come back in 40 years' time, we'll see sustainability embedded in a lot of other areas, energy, water, and in fact, if you look around the grounds here, there's a great opportunity to enhance biodiversity as well. You want a world and a country that you live in for your children and grandchildren to be much better than what it was when you were young.